As much as I love combustion engine cars, especially stick shifts and manuals, I still love what's happening with the electric car revolution. I'm a car guy, but I'm also a tech guy, and every year that a new MacBook comes out, I'm the first one to buy a new one. And cars like this are basically computers on wheels. So that's why I got excited when Cadillac brought out their Cadillac Lyric debut edition in 2023. The first generation of the Cadillac Lyric is definitely really impressive, but this is also the first version. Imagine what this is gonna look like a few years from now. So in this video, I'm gonna show you what this thing's all about. There's a lot going on at the front end of this car with an interesting design. It's aggressive and sophisticated at the same time. The coolest aspect of the exterior design is the lighting, not just in the front, but also in the back. The taillights, the headlights, these long strips of lights, it's a very unique look. This Cadillac Lyric is luxurious, spacious, and it's got a lot of trunk space. And if this is not enough trunk space for you, you got two buttons to automatically get the seats down. That's easy. With this much room, if you get tired driving, pull over, lay the seats down, and go to sleep. Not happy with the storage? No problem. Lift this up, and you can put more stuff in here. It's a good thing there's a lot of space back there because in the front, you're out of luck. Very nice and roomy in the back seat. You even have an indentation for your knees and legs. Perfectly fine for road trips or even just being driven around town. This Cadillac really does have luxury written all over it. This is an interesting way to do door handles. Push on this, but instead of pulling this, use this to pull the door. But it only exists for the front door. I'm not sure why they don't have the same thing for the back doors. These are nicely designed door panels with very fine details and etching. This is an extremely roomy and luxurious interior. There's just so much space. And it's also very high tech as you would expect with this debut edition Lyric. This digital display right here wraps around and takes up half of the dashboard, which I think is really cool. This is Cadillac's latest EV creation. So naturally you'd expect this to be full of tech. You turn the car on and you're greeted with some gentle chimes and colors in the steering wheel. This is an interesting way to change the gears. Instead of just pushing this up or down, you have to pull it forward and then go into drive or reverse. Some artificial motor sounds with your drive type, collision detection systems, automatic super cruise lane change. You have options to park and exit your specified parking spots. If you have a teen driver, you can keep an eye on how they're driving. And this touchscreen is super smooth, very easy to use. Or if you don't want to use the touch screen, you have a dial that you can manipulate and some buttons. You can change the dash display and go with your standard gauge or energy usage, map, battery usage, and so on. So not a huge amount of tech, but the tech that is in the car is very nicely done with a very high level of sophistication. They were thoughtful. They have a very nice, convenient location to put your phone but they're also very clear that you should not put keys or coins or paper clips and that it can get hot. So remember folks, it's only for your phone. These are some nice graphics as you switch between sport, snow, ice. Very nicely done. Before you hit the glove box release button, warn your passenger, it's pretty violent. So to change the direction of the air and the air vents, you have these two levers that you use. It's like a mini joystick. In a Cadillac Lyric, you gotta have massage seats. This is a comfortable car made even more comfortable with massage seats. And let the massage rolling begin. Doesn't matter if you're in the front seat or in the back seat, you're surrounded by luxury the whole time. The seats are nicely designed with this blue accent going all the way down. Very comfortable seats too. Also a big shout out to my friends at Covert Cadillac for letting me borrow this Lyric. First impressions driving this, it's very smooth and comfortable, quiet, kind of like a vault. You don't hear anything from the outside. On long road trips, this would definitely be an ideal car, barring the battery charging situation. But even if you wanted to drive this around town, this would be a really comfortable ride. 
And it's one of those cars where you'd rather be driven in than drive it yourself just because you can relax. And if you turn on the massaging seats in this car, forget it. You won't be able to stay awake. You're going to immediately pass out. I think this car was designed for insomniacs. If you have a hard time falling asleep, just ride in this thing and it will put you to sleep. This is not the fastest car you've driven. It doesn't have a ton of horsepower and torque. But because it's electric, you still have enough to where it doesn't bog down and doesn't feel terribly slow. And I'm sure future versions of the Lyric will be a lot faster than this. But because this car is geared towards comfort and luxury, you're not really coming into this expecting a whole lot of power and speed. The more I'm driving around in this thing, the more I'm realizing of how good of a car it is when it comes to just sheer ride comfort and relaxation. It absorbs and handles the bump so effortlessly. This is a lot of rain pouring down, and this car is handling it pretty well. The Lyric comes with Super Cruise, but I can't enable it because it's only on certain roads, and apparently the road that I'm on doesn't have it. It's pre-mapped roads that GM has already done to create hands-free driving, and it'll do things like automatic lane change and keep the car in the lane. It would have been interesting to try that out in this, but uh, not going to happen today. So, in case you are wondering how this is in the rain, that was an unexpected test drive in the rain. I'm happy to say that this thing passed with flying colors. I'm actually really impressed by the Cadillac Lyric. This is such a great car. And I think $60,000 is not a bad price at all. This is extremely luxurious, very high-end, very premium. And also, this is the first edition of the Lyric. Think about the future versions in 2024, 2025, and beyond. If this is what Cadillac is starting off with, I think the future versions of the Lyric are going to be that much better. But I have to say, this is a very impressive start. And once these cars are much easier to charge and electric vehicles are the norm, I think this will be a very worthy contender to all of the other stuff that's out there. If you add more electric motors and make this more powerful, this will be a car that ranks at the top end of the electric vehicle offering, so I'm very eager to see what else comes out. I don't think a lot of people are paying attention to the Lyric, but I think they will soon. This is kind of flying under the radar right now, but in a few years, I think this will be one of the top competitors in this category.